As a doctor looking after patients taking immunosuppressant medication for autoimmune disease, the traditional assumption is that such people are at very high risk in the setting of infectious disease. However, they may have an advantage in the case of COVID-19. It appears that the overreaction of the immune system, the so-called cytokine storm, is particularly damaging in COVID-19, which means that people taking immunosuppressive medication may in fact be protected. Our aim is to define the course and immune response to COVID-19 in patients with systemic autoimmune diseases and to determine if the condition is more or less severe in these immunosuppressed patients. Through the Rare Kidney Disease Biobank, we have access to an engaged and well-connected network of people with ankyovasculitis, a model autoimmune disease, who are eager to help us understand more about the condition. Vasculitis patients who test positive for COVID-19 will provide clinical samples and detailed clinical information to allow us to measure and determine the types of immune cells that are involved in the infection. This will allow us to better understand how the immune system responds to the virus and to assess whether immunosuppressive medication could in fact be used to treat the condition. It also allows us to provide clear guidance to patients regarding cocooning, and guidance on how they should use their current immunosuppressant medication in the face of COVID-19 circulating in the community.